Good afternoon from Yami B TV. Right, we're going to go back in the day now. Uh, we're going to remember that day when Phil actually saved me uh, from getting a hiding, if you get what I mean, when Yami done an erratic one down the gym um, 2006. Then when we was all down the gym, I think me, Feroz, Germ, Danger, um, Bosey, um, Skippy, who else was there? Um, Dave Smith, um, I think Rog was there. Um, I think chaos. Everyone was there in the gym that night, right? Phil Curry was on duty, and me being me, I suppose, um, got into a, a bit of a argument playfully with one of my younger ones, right, from Northwest. Quite a big geezer as well. <laughs> he was quite hefty, but it was my boy. You know what I mean? But you know, sometimes it gets irritating when people are pinching you and running off and all that. You have to deal with these these youngsters when they come to jail sometimes at 20, 21, and they've been away five, six years. And um, their childish ways are a bit... But we used to do all that in Ellsbury, and I was terrible for it. I used to irritate everyone as well. So we got into the hall, right? It was time to go back, and his name begins with S, right? So we're there, and he's just, I, I was getting irritated um, for whatever reasons. So in a split second of an eye, right, a blink of an eye, I went, I turned around, and I went, bang. I punched him in the mouth. I didn't even realise I'd done it. Um, you know, when you just throw one, but it wasn't really a killer blow. Like, I didn't put nothing behind it. I was just kind of like, you're getting on my nerves, like, bang. Didn't think about it. And before I knew it, he put his arms around me, and put me on the floor, wrapped me up, not wrapped me up, but he used all his weight and he got me down straight away kind of thing. Um, he put both of his legs on my hands, right? And all of them lot was saying, oi, 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 oi. Um, I don't think he was going to beat me, but out of the blue, Phil Curry, rest in peace, my boys, disjointed me this morning that Phil Curry uh, went, oi, as his hand was pinning down the second hand and pulled him because Phil was a lump then, you know. And Phil pulled him off, I think. I think even John Gray. John Gray thought it was serious, like, the fight. And he come, like, John was going, oh, hey, like, what's going on? But it wasn't. I don't know if, I don't know if S was going to throw one at me while I was on the floor, but it didn't get to that stage. But it just shows you what kind of man Uncle Phil was. Um, I love the man I did. I'll do a special tribute this week. Once I'm over this bug and get to day out of the way, we've got some massive interviews coming up. Oh, I'll keep my eye on the ball. He would have been proud of me. Um, but we will be representing Phil and uh, the best thing we can do is make sure um, you get his book as a, you know, a mark of respect, if anything. But what a massive read. I'm going to go into some of those chapters this week, especially after I do the tribute. But that was, that was I remember that. I think I told that mum Yonks way back in the day, two, three years ago. I mentioned it on a podcast um, that two, twice in my life, the two prison officers kind of came to my rescue. But where Phil was a lead supporter, I knew that he was sticking up for me, doing his job. But really, he was on my side. Sending loads of love to me.